Hey you guys, what's up, Pokemon Crystal. So in the last episode we took on Misty and won. Um, we need to head back down to the Million City so we can go to Pewter City. We need to go this way. I think we already got our root phone counter so it's fine. Two pulls are anyway, which is not really going to help down now. We should be able to just walk through now. Well, I mean, we're going to walk through Sacramon City. For those of you who are just starting power means we can now walk through these places. Whereas we couldn't before. We need to get to Diglett's Cave, so then we can wait we need to wake up a snark that blocks it. Prison we fought all the strangers before, so it's fine. Should be east of here. Um, I think we have the radio set. It woke up. I don't know if it was still your Snorlax. No, it's not. It changed to a Caterpie. <laughs> you level 50. Obviously, we're not going to catch it. But we should be able to wipe it in one hit. But we don't need Count one up and dig this cave though. It's a scammery. It's on level 2, so I'm gonna run from it. And leave. So that's the way we have to plug and count other things while we're in here. Just before we hit the ladders. Oh, it is my scam room. So, we know flying type. So I put them to it too, but we can use cut to get through here. And we're now in Pewter City. Um, and we've got to take on Brock. I can make sure I can find the gym. We got another another gym badge. I don't know if I the trainers. We should be perfect leveled, I think. I don't know what box levels are. Futile five four. One guys probably won't knock it out. No one here. It uses rock side, that's gonna hurt. Super effective. Okay, well, that did a hundred points in damage. You just screech through its next move. We'll use Sacred Fire, which should do more damage. Hopefully. Does knock it out. Let's go to the rock side again. It probably done for like maybe a lot more. We need even a crit would have been close to being knocked out in one. It's like 13 levels. Nice fight rock. For another gym badge. The spy Pokemon starts off with Suicune. Level 49. Um, Definitely gonna switch. And then this obvious switch is to Mewtwo. He sets up Brain Dance. I uh, will use Shadow Ball. That didn't do much, but will be in. Does 54. Be swift. It is very risky. No, I think we do survive a crit, I think. I 
thing we might need to have a heal or switch. Yeah, I think we I think we switch to our water type. That should do, that should do not much even with the rain. We use strength. That's been like solid 53 damage to me to a Mewtwo. Mirror solid 53. Armor star should stay in. And we choose surf. Be really good if the rain was all up. So that'd probably mean this probably does one hit. Doesn't it? You then use water gun, which is probably 10. 12. And you strength to just finish it off. Two down. Teddy Ursa. We should be fine to stay in. Level 53. We use strength. Is the rash. Dash did quite a bit, but two strands should knock it out. So he's good on it, not in, in red health range, it's not his Brock's not uses potions. Voltorb, we have an obvious switch into Veal because we're still growing, which means it's a large attack news can't hit us. Does go for a light screw a light a light a light screw. Even that oh, an earthquake still does knock it out. Find a Pokemon is a dig work. The other switches back to tank. Because if it, if it did use dig, we could have used earthquake. And earthquake does double damage. But Sir should do should easily one hit. And that's another gym match. The border bet is now been achieved. You know, go heal. So what we're gonna do? That's health. That sweeping did a lot of damage to me too though. That'll be of course where we entered it episode. So thank you for watching. Remember to like, subscribe, and until next time, see ya!